Good Wednesday morning, everyone. And I'm so glad you tuned in to our anniversary week. This is the 15 year anniversary of Saddleback Laguna, Laguna Woods coming on Sunday. And oh, do we have a wonderful day for you on Sunday. I hope you can come uh, if you don't have a church home or Saddleback Church is your church home. We're going to have scrambled eggs with all the toppings that you can imagine. Uh, lots of surprises in the service. And it'll be a wonderful time of celebrating God. And, and this verse that is kind of our verse for this week, and it's Psalm 77 at verse 11, where it says, I will remember the deeds of the Lord. Yes, I will remember your miracles of long ago. Now, we're actually not looking at long ago. This is the last 15 years. And in that time, one of the highlights was the fact that we, for a good number of those years, we did what we called our food pantry. And we were able to run it out of, most of the time, out of Clubhouse 7, a few times out of Clubhouse 5. And then as COVID hit, we had to move to doing it in the uh, parking lots of various churches who all allowed us to use their parking lots. And that was such a blessing to partner together in that. But this show reminisces on how God used us to allow, allow people to come into Clubhouse 6 and shop for their own food that they would take. And it was a blessing to them, but I think far more of a blessing to us. And so as we reminisce what God allowed us to do during this 15 years, this is a highlight to me. And as we talk, as I get to talk to people, just watch for their happiness and joy. And uh, they were being blessed too. So enjoy this, but praise God for it. We love meeting needs and however we can. This was just one of many ways that we have been able to do it. Today we come to a, an event that really what the church is all about, and that's helping others. In fact, let's start with the verse for the day, which comes out of Matthew 19. And it, Jesus was asked, what's the most important commandments? And he said, to love the Lord your God and to love your neighbor as yourself. And that's what we're doing. Now that command was to us as individuals for sure. And we're to do that. But it's also to his church. The difference with our food pantry is you get to shop. These are the things, come on with me. These are the things that you get to choose. My favorite, peanut butter. Okay, come on down. Okay, here we have Francois. I've got, I've got Francois with me. What, what are the products you have to give? Oh, yes, we have a lot of stuff here, you know. The kind of, the, we call it sauce, uh, tomato sauce, and for spaghetti, and also tomato uh, pasta sauce. Okay. Right, yeah. So you're like the tomato sauce expert, but you have some other vegetables. Yeah, right. Well, we're going to move on down the line. And what do you have this morning? I have soups, all what kinds kind of, of soups? soups. We've got some organic soup, we got broth, we've got a, a chicken noodle, tomato, cream of mushroom, and uh, all kinds of beef in there yeah. too. Lots well, that's what I was telling them. They get to come and they choose what they like. It's not like we pre-make the bag. Is that correct? That's correct. They yeah. choose what they want and we let them choose what they want. But they will ask okay. if we have certain things and then we'll say, yeah, we'll look, start looking around and trying to find them yeah. for them. Yeah, yeah. Let's go on down and you'll see. How you doing, Ling? Yeah, hello. What do you have? Uh, extra items. This is where you really pick and choose. Uh, like what? Oh, all kinds, breadcrumbs, cookies, yeah. uh, power bars, etc. Love that. Let's just take a look. Let's just take a look here. Power bars. Now, this is not something I usually eat, but, oh, wait. Yes, I do. Nature Valley peanut with oats. Oh, my gosh. So often I come here and I think I need to get... I need to get eating myself. 
this is this is kind of the end result. They started driving the picking up the the food from our big saddleback pantry in Lake Forest. You know our our combined food pantry of, of Saddleback is one of the largest in Orange County because we have five different locations that are permanent and then several mobile ones like ours. So early in the morning, they drive in the truck, a team of people unloads the truck and comes in here and sets it all up so that folks can come by and shop and uh, get what the, exactly what they need. I love this ministry, and I love the people that are willing to do it. Let's just go a little bit further and uh, see what we can find. So, what do you have to share this morning? Apple juice, uh, regular juices, and lots and lots of breads, bagels. I love those bread items. Yeah, well, actually, I love the juice, too, but how are you guys doing? Good, doing great. We what what time like what time did you guys start? Who wants to say? About eight. About eight. And it's now about ten thirty. How long do you go? Till eleven. Eleven. Eleven o'clock. Okay. Yeah. So would you say to folks, what is the qualify? What, what 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 you you don't actually have to qualify to come down and shop or anything, do you? It's a process they go throughout at the front desk. But it's really for the community. So I always say it's Laguna Woods people serving Laguna Woods people. And that's a beautiful thing. All right. Down here we have more bread. Wouldn't you say? Yes. I love this. Jeff, this is so amazing. I love this bread. <laughs> well, we've had a good time this morning, and all I can say is I hope you're getting a good feel for what church life is like. It's not the pastor by any means doing everything. But what I do do is get to enjoy the fellowship of all these servant leaders who are out here out of the goodness of their heart. So now we're out front where the people check in to go shopping as we just saw. So these folks, what is the process of, so they come up here, they have, if you just want to walk in, you go evidently in this line and you get to see Becky. Yes, I get to see all the walk-ins, then the new people. and also How many did you have today? Today we have uh, nine eight, walk ins so far. Okay. So people were saying in there that it's usually the same people, but at least you had nine new people. Yeah, well, no, not, not two new people. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Last previous. month. Okay, so say that, that again. That means they weren't here last month, okay. so they come in as a walk-in okay. this month. Great. And Elizabeth, what do you do? Everything She's else. No. <laughs> you the boss. Not really. I just try to maintain control here. Okay, well, thanks, you guys, for all. And actually, we were kidding Walt. This is Walt, guys. He is our truck driver and extraordinaire. Now, you seem to be the cupcake specialist. Right. The sweets. It's the sweets. He said the sweetest people handle the sweets. I just was curious, so why do you volunteer here? I enjoy this. I enjoy the camaraderie. Okay. It's fun. Yeah. Enjoy seeing meeting people. How about you? You're doing something nice. How about you, David? Well, basically the same thing. It's it's fu fulfilling the volunteer and helping people. Yeah. Well, I wanted to ask that because people often think that serving is hard work. And they do work hard, but it's such a blessing, as you guys just said, to get to be, meet new friends, meet new people, and help meet needs. Exactly. Well, I, I, I thank you for serving. Well, that's it for today. This is a busy week. I hope you're enjoying it. See you tomorrow. Oh, come to the Father through Jesus the Son.